next story is quite extraordinary. Scientists have been able to develop a new test for Parkinson's after one woman discovered she could smell the disease. Now, this sounds bizarre, but it is totally real and a huge breakthrough. Natalia Hockera is here to tell us more. Natalia, I'm intrigued. I know, it sounds made up, right? But this has been a test in the making for years and it's been helped by a lady called Joy Milne. Now, she has a rare condition called hyperosmia, which gives her a heightened sense of smell. Now, Joy is 72 now, but when her late husband was 32, she first noticed that he had a different scent, different smell. Uh, and whilst he was showering just the same, she left it there. And it wasn't until 12 years later, when he was diagnosed with Parkinson's, that she realised that she had been smelling the disease. And she told me about that moment earlier. I walked into a Parkinson's UK meeting, the first meeting with Parkinson's, and I walked in, sort of stood there and thought, the smell of Parkinson's is in this room. It's the same smell as Liz. So when I got him home, I sat him down at the dining room table and said to him, um, I've got something to tell you. Those people in that room smell the same as you. So has Joy been able to use her sense of smell to help the world of science? Well, there isn't a definitive test for Parkinson's, but Joy has been working with a team of scientists at the University of Manchester to develop a simple swab test. And they have found that it's 95% accurate in their lab settings. So whilst there isn't a current cure for Parkinson's, there are a few drugs in the pipeline. And Joy is hoping that when her test is rolled out, there will be a treatment. Well, let's hope so. Natalia, thank you. Thank you.